As a longtime traffic analyst in Massachusetts, I think I can say with confidence that things never stay the same. Traffic patterns vary by time of day, season of the year, and we all know what it's like driving to the Cape on a summer afternoon. Over the long term, neighborhoods grow, populations move, it's always something different. Understanding traffic is one aspect of emergency planning at the Pilgrim Nuclear Power Station because it impacts the safety of residents, first responders, and other emergency personnel in the unlikely event of an accident at the plant. Why unlikely? Because Pilgrim was built from the ground up to include safety systems, backup safety systems, and backups to the backup systems, all engineered with one goal in mind, to keep employees, neighbors, and the surrounding community safe. What else can Pilgrim Power do to fully prepare should an accident happen, however small the chance might be? For starters, they consider a whole host of variables, not just traffic, but weather conditions, communications, human behavior, and all manner of potential threats, both natural and man-made. Accounting for these variables is an ongoing process at Pilgrim Nuclear Power Station, where emergency planners continually update and refine their work. This involves regular on-site safety drills where personnel rehearse for everything from power outages to earthquakes to terror attacks. It also means daily collaboration with national, state, and local authorities, including the Massachusetts Emergency Management Agency, the Mass Department of Public Health, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, the Department of Homeland Security, the U.S. Coast Guard, as well as state and local police, firefighters, and other first responders. The main function of my department is ensuring that the sites implement their emergency planning expeditiously. We have four teams that are on call every week. We have quarterly drills for each team. Every other year we have an exercise which NRC and FEMA comes in to evaluate. We're always looking to make improvements. The emergency planning staff at Pilgrim Power also work with KLD, a leading authority on traffic engineering and emergency planning. KLD uses sophisticated computer modeling to map out evacuation routes for all those who live and work within a 10-mile radius of the plant, and recently completed a detailed study of traffic leading on and off Cape Cod. Their work factors in a wide range of scenarios that could affect traffic during a possible evacuation, like whether it's rush hour or midday, winter or summer. They consider weather conditions like wind direction or snowfall amounts, even how special events such as rock concerts or big games might impact travel routes throughout the area. KLD has done evacuation time estimate studies basically since the early 1980s. We've done the evacuation time estimates for 59 of the 65 sites in the United States. Uh, we've also done six in Japan, two in Canada, and one in Taiwan. A traffic engineering study, basically you're looking at the supply and the demand, the supply being the roadways that you have available, and the demand being the number of vehicles that have to be uh, serviced by that roadway. So in an evacuation, your demand are all the people that are within that 10-mile emergency planning zone for the nuclear plant, and your supply is all the roadways that are in existence. So we take traffic engineering models that interact that supply and that demand, and that's the way we're able to predict how long it would take to clear all of those vehicles using those roadways. But it's a constant interaction between the county agencies, the state agencies, Entergy, and the evacuation time estimate contractor. After more than four decades in operation, the Pilgrim Nuclear Power Station has never had a serious emergency. But they do pay close attention to industrial accidents, storms, and earthquakes in other parts of the world. By studying these events, emergency planners at Pilgrim Power gain critical knowledge that can only enhance their readiness in case of an accident. If an emergency were to occur, state and local officials as well as plant officials have the tools and resources in place to advise you on the proper course of action, like whether to shelter or evacuate. If it's the latter, they will direct you toward the fastest routes away from the area. 
By studying every possible scenario, using advanced computer systems and modeling techniques, and conducting regular safety drills to assure all systems work as planned, the Pilgrim Nuclear Power Station is confident that in the unlikely event of an emergency, your safety and that of your family, friends, and co-workers is assured.